During a hearing on 11 Jan, a bankruptcy attorney stated that crypto exchange FTX had recovered more than $5 billion in various assets, not including another $425 million in crypto held by the Securities Commission of the Bahamas. We have located over $5 billion in cash, liquid car cryptocurrency and liquid investment securities measured at petition date value. It simply does not ascribe any value to holdings of dozens of illiquid cryptocurrency tokens where our holdings are so large relative to total supply that our positions cannot be sold without significantly affecting the market for the token, said Sullivan and Cromwell attorney Adam Landis on behalf of FTX. The FTX arena is no more. As the contagion from the collapse of FTX continues to spread, a Florida judge stripped fallen cryptocurrency exchange FTX of its naming rights to the home of the Miami Heat on Wednesday. The news comes after a court hearing in the bankruptcy court of Delaware, where attorneys told the court that the funds from Alameda Research funded the deal with Miami-Dade County. The county had already received approval to take down FTX Senate after the exchange filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy protection last November. Today's ruling was made retroactive to December 31, 2022. Today's order finalized the party's separation and now allows the owners of the Miami Heat Arena to look for new bidders and partnerships on the building. A massive amount of ETH is about to be released. During a meeting on December 8, Ethereum developers decided to make staked ETH on Ethereum's beacon chain withdrawable as early as March 2023 with the Shanghai update. Last week, the meeting was ratified. Within Ethereum's POS system, the beacon chain has a $21 billion stake. Additional ETH is voluntarily staked into the beacon chain on a daily basis and cannot be withdrawn until Shanghai goes live. As a result, by March, the beacon chain will have far surpassed 16 million ETH. Five Ethereum improvement proposals will be included in the Shanghai update, EIP-3540, EIP-3670, EIP-4200, EIP-4570 and eip 5450. These proposals describe changes to the Ethereum virtual machine that will allow staked Ether withdrawals. On September 15, 2022, the POS beacon chain was activated on the Ethereum mainnet with the merge. Activating the beacon chain converted Ethereum to a purely proof-of-stake algorithm, giving stakeholders a direct role in transaction confirmation. In the upcoming segment, we will update you about the following news. Thai regulator probes Zipmex crypto exchange amid acquisition. Gala deletes collaboration tweet with Dwayne Johnson, token planches. Pune's Raja Dinkar Kelkar Museum to be accessible on Metaverse platform. Stay tuned for more updates.